it won't happen nigeria won't break those agitating for it are dreamers says tako Bratai. good morning everyone and thank you for tuning in and listening to this headline that we got here this morning as our headline for this morning says here that it won't happen nigeria won't break those who are agitating for it are dreamers says tako Bratai. Former Chief of Army Staff Lieutenant General Takor Buratai has told those who are wishing for Nigeria's um, disintegrate to perish the thought, predicting that Nigeria would continue to remain a united nation. Buratai, Buratai spoke in Kuta, Oshun State on Sunday at the 60th birthday celebration of Olowu of Kuta, Oba Adekunle Oyeludwe at an event attended by dignitaries, including Oni of Ife, Oba, Oba Adiyeye Ogunwusi, former President Olusegun Gwen Obasanjo, former Governor um, Ola Gunjoye Oyola of Oshun State, among many others. The former army boss, who described Olowu Kuta as a distribilized Nigerian who has shown love to people across all ethnic groups in the country. It says those agitating that the country should um, break up must be ready to carve out their own path and move it to the ocean. Noting that the, that, that the experience of civil war has taught Nigerians that agitation to divide the country would always fail. Buratai called for unity and further, uh, and further enhanced Nigerian development. You know that Nigeria is one. Unless you remove those people who are agitating and drift them to the Atlantic, we will remain one. Nigeria will remain one Nigeria. Anybody who wants to live in Nigeria should carry their part of the land and take it to the Atlantic Ocean, not within the Nigerian territory. It is very clear the level of integration. There are many houses here. There are many Yoruba and Igbos in the north. So we should not allow politics to be cloud our sense of unity and sovereignty. Anybody that says that he wants to leave Nigeria is a dreamer because we had bitter experience during the civil war. So it is not something that we we'll joke with, Buratai said. He advised Nigerians to embrace peace and focus on development, adding that the country should work more further. Yes, the country should work more further concerning its unity by taking concrete action that would bring about development and not by mere utterance. In his remark about Olu, Olu Oyelude said he would continue to champion cause of unity and progress for Nigeria, calling on well-meaning Nigerians to work for the country's unity and progress. And that is all we have for you concerning this headline today this morning, which says here that it won't happen. Nigeria won't break. Those who are agitating for it are dreamers, says Tako Buratai. Well, you heard it from me this morning. Like, what is this um, command chief of, um, the chief of defense staff saying? And before I move on, don't forget, if you're not a um, subscriber, do well as you tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and leave a like on this video to get more updates concerning this in the next feature to come. Because this man, the former chief of army staff, Lieutenant General, Lieutenant General Tako Burutai, he told all those who are wishing Nigeria to divide, yes, who are wishing Nigeria to divide, predicting that Nigeria would continue to remain a united nation. Meaning that he's telling all those Russian agitators, all those um, Yoruba nation agitators, or any other agitation that is happening in the country, that all those people who are wishing that the country should divide, that the country will never divide, that Nigeria will become a united nation, said by Takobo Tayo. Yes, he said all this in Kuta, Oshun State, on Sunday at the 60th birthday celebration of Olowu of Kuta. Like, seriously, Takobo Tayo, he described Olowu Kuta as a civilized Nigerian who has shown love to people across all ethnic groups in the country. He then says that all those who are agitating that the country should divide must be ready to, to carve out their own path and move it to the ocean. Meaning that if you want Nigeria to divide, he's telling you that since, since you want Nigeria to divide, carve out your own piece of land and move it to the Atlantic Ocean, then you can remain one then, then you can be one country. Yes, if it's possible you can do that. That is what Tako Burita is saying. He says that, that noting that the experience of the civil war that happened some years ago, it has taught Nigerians that agitation to divide the country would always fail. So the civil, the civil war that happened a long time ago, that taught Nigerians that agitation to divide the country would always fail. 
we will type call for unity to further enhance Nigerian development. Yes, it, it's calling for unity. And to me, I, I really support him because I need so Nigeria just needs to be united. We know how to face all our problems. We can only solve all our problems together, not divided. He said, you know that Nigeria is one. Unless those people who are agitating and, and, and drift them to the Atlantic, I mean that unless these people who are agitating can go away, if, if possible, carry out the lands to the Atlantic, we will remain one Nigeria. Anybody who wants to leave Nigeria should carry that part of the land and take it to the Atlantic Ocean, not within the Nigerian territory. It is very clear of the level of integration. Yes, if you want to leave the Nigeria, carry out your land, take it to the Atlantic Ocean, then we know that uh, hey, you are in one country. That, that, that's what Taco Vita is just saying here. And to me, he's making a, a, a lot of sense. Yes, he's making a lot of sense. He also says that there are many houses in this place. And there are many Yoruba and Igbos in the north. So we should not allow politics to be cloud our sense of unity and sovereignty. Yes, we should not allow politics to be cloud our sense of humility and sovereignty. Our sense of unity and sovereignty. It says that anybody that says that he or, he or she that who, who wants to leave Nigeria is a dreamer. Because we had bitter experience during the civil war. And nobody wants that civil war to happen again in the country, believe me. Nobody wants that ever. So it is not something that we will joke about. It's not something that we'll joke with. Yes, agitation is not something that we'll joke with. But he advised Nigerians to embrace peace and focus on development, saying that the country would work more to further, to further cement its unity by taking concrete action that would bring about development and and not by mere utterance. I mean, that's urging Nigerians that we should just focus on developing our country, not agitating. But what do you guys think? Let me see your comment below in the comment section. Don't forget to leave a like on this video. Then tap the subscribe button here to be the one with the notification bell. So that anytime we have any new video concerning this, you'll be the first to get notified about it. Once again, thank you all for tuning in and have a wonderful day ahead of you.